I see I'm you over there. there. I see you over there, gold zombie. I'm more concerned about your two creeper friends, though, than particularly you. Now, where did the other one go? Oops, I went the ender chest. I don't want that. There we go. You have an awesome bow. I've seen that in the uh, in the episode. Yeah, I know. Oh yeah, by the way, do you want to go uh, get those diamonds? Yeah, let's do that next. Um, they're down in the mining chest. Right. I'm so concerned, you know, about a creeper blowing up in Spawn Town because I'm I'm so frightened that I'm going to blow something up that somebody really likes and then they're <laughs> going to hate me for it. <laughs> <laughs> it's it's happened. It's happened plenty of times. We all do it one time at least. This is why whenever I'm on the server on my own, I never let it be night time. <laughs> here they are. Oh yeah, they're at the top, aren't they? Yep. I hear a zombie coming. How many diamonds did we get in the end? Uh, three. I'll give you the uh, honor of mining the diamonds. No efficiency? Bad man. Bad. Uh, that's... <laughs> Seven in the end. It's not bad. Seven? Nice. Not bad. That can go with the eight I already have, and that will give me 15. That's not a bad starting haul. You can start up and get a get a sword and a pickaxe. Yeah, that's I'll definitely... If you want to. Let me see. I've got, like, two, uh, two pickaxes, actually. Two fortune picks. Just, just come and take a look inside my shack at how many chests of just random junk I've picked up already. <laughs> Yeah, that uh, starts that starts to happen. Yeah, <laughs> look at that. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven chests in total. It's just all Not full bad. of stuff. This Not is why. That's what I raided out of that hole. Maybe you might be able to shed some light on that. Let me take you over there and let's see if you know anything about it. I. Nobody knows anything about it per se, but nobody's really seen it. It's somewhere around here. There it is. Maybe you know something about this. Um, you found it. Welcome. It was just full of chests, but I there was no idea. Nobody yet wanted it. Nobody wanted it, so that's, that's kind of weird. It oh. looked like somebody's inventory. It can't be that long ago because there was coal blocks in there, so it must have been sometime after one of the 1.6 snapshots that added the coal block. Right, but this plot wasn't built until. Oh, I don't know when this plot was built, actually. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know whether that was intended for the person who eventually lived in this plot, or whether it was part of a prank that just got left, or... I, I really know. don't know. Or if, or if they even planted it there? I don't know. That's a good question. I have no idea. So I guess what I need to do now is kind of check out what this chest is over here with the... Uh... Oh, that that is just awesome. What's that? That one dirt block, and there's a skeleton on it. <laughs> that, that was just perfect. I'm glad I got that on camera. <laughs> yeah, um, Mondo has a uh, one block floating in the air, and there's a chicken on top of it. <laughs> and he's sworn that he's never going to move that block, ever. Just so that the chicken stays there. It, yeah, the chicken's just going to stay there. Right then, here's the coal chunks. That's how I recognize where the portal is. I hope that at least one of the coal chunks gets left behind as a monument. Oh, Cracker Jacks. This is <laughs> I don't know who uh, Cracker Jack is, actually. I've never seen him. Ah, uh, that's David Cracker. Oh! <laughs> oh, I start, oh! I started, calling him, I started calling him Cracker Jack one time, so uh, he just kind of... He just kind of kept it. <laughs> oh, I didn't know who he was. I just thought it was somebody that goes by a different name on Skype, but oh, that's not bad. I got a good amount of coal here. Three, six, nine, ten stacks. Nice. Ten stacks of coal. That's going to keep me going for a while. Is there a crafting bench around? I'll make some coal blocks. Yeah, there's one over uh, over here by spawn. Yeah. There we go. Let's put these in here. I 
don't know if you've seen this about my house. I'll have to show you my basement that I've been working on. Yeah, uh, 64 blocks of coal. <laughs> Not bad. And I didn't even intend for people to, like, donate to me. I just wanted to know if they were going to break them down afterwards. <laughs> but now I've got... Right. Somebody's going to have to make an internet gif about that. Been on the <laughs> server one week, 64 coal blocks, win. <laughs> so this is uh, what I've built so far. I've seen this, this river. I think this looks awesome. Yeah. I'm not going to lie, this is fantastic. I would have never thought to do that. I just had the idea one day. I'm like, I'm going to re uh, replace the bottom of the river with glass. And then carve it out. And then carve it out. I really like th I don't know, the look. I I didn't have any plans for this place at at the start, but this is going to be like mostly farms and stuff like that. Yeah. Um, I really like but, the base uh, that you've got going on here, actually, with the river. It looks awesome. I'm gonna grow some grass. Yeah. I know that in version, well, the next snapshot version, there's actually dirt has a separate ID now, so that you can get a specialist type of dirt that doesn't, um, with grass that doesn't grow to it. But I think that's only oh, going to be. Oh, that'd be nice. But I don't know whether that's going to be commands only because they've released a new type of grass, like mycelium and grass. There's now going to be, a, I think it's called podzol. Uh, they've released that. Jeb right, showed a the, screenshot. Uh, yeah, for the new biome, and there's at least one more that Gre Jeb um, released on a uh, screenshot, but we've not seen the name of that yet. So, um, did, did you see the one with the new pine trees and stuff? Yeah, I saw that. That just looks awesome. That that biome, they're really gonna, they're really outdoing themselves, I think, this time with the biomes. Yeah. Um, they seem like they're gonna add like variants to other biomes as well. Like you can get pine trees in the extreme hills now in certain places, and stuff like that. Yep. They're That's just really, a. It's just so much better now. Yeah, I think they've really, they knew that they had to up their game after what happened with 1.6. Most people were expecting it to be some sort of major update, and in some ways it was. It was a major update for all the back-end stuff, like the new launcher and so forth. But there was not many features added into it. Aside from the horses, everything else was kind of just like decoration blocks and convenience items, really. Right. So, I think Although they knew... I will knew say the coal blocks are nice. They are. I think there's some sort of expectation now um, that 1.7 is going to be a big update. And so far, they've kind of. Uh, they've not let down. I wouldn't be. I would be surprised if they if it isn't a big update. Yeah, I have a feeling though that it's going to be split into two parts, like the adventure update was, and 1.8 will add all the new mobs that they want to add. They've had some interest in doing that. Right. So we'll just have to wait and see on that one. Do you want to take me to these horse planes then? Because I don't know where these are. Oh yeah, sure. Um. Do you have a saddle, by the way? Uh, there's one in a dungeon. Uh, let me let me go grab that. Okay. Because I was doing a bit of caving, and I actually found a, a dungeon completely left with the loot in the chest in my plot. Um, there wasn't really anything valuable aside from the saddle in there. No enchanted books or anything. I imagine if there were any enchanted books, they were taken. But right. nothing else, really. Now I've got to try and find it again. <laughs> I think I know the way to get there. Um, well, this will be uh, the live stream highlight. Fretwell gets a horse. I haven't done too much with them. I don't know how I feel about them, really. They're okay, but I don't really think that you would need one. But um, maybe that's just me. Don't, don't say anything to Ross. <laughs> 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 he'll, he'll end up ranting. Uh, so, he he's 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 one of those players that thinks that Minecraft should uh, uh, stopped updating after 1.0. Oh oh yeah yeah yeah, okay. Um, and that you know they should have had people pay to get um, more updates and stuff uh, like that. And it's like, no, it does it doesn't make sense really. 
Not for a game like Minecraft, it, it doesn't work. I mean, for some games, it is a, a good model to follow. Um, but for a lot of games, it's not really. It, it doesn't work. Where are you, by the right. way? Um, this, cave the, is, uh, this cave is this cave is kind of difficult, but... Oh, here's the dungeon, I think. I've got to be careful here, because I hear zombies all around me. There's the saddle. They're pathing to me, I hear them. <laughs> nope, that's the wrong exit. That's not really where I, really I want to be. Maybe up the here? Zombies are just... Are, um, but they cause really bad lag. Yeah. I mean... I've been trying to be careful with my village about that because my village can cause lag. If it... Yeah. Yeah. The actual bug itself is when they are, there's so many zombies and they can't reach the target. So if they get locked onto a villager, for example, but they can't get to that villager, it starts to slow it down. Right. So that's the, that's the problem. Unless you kind of set up some sort of trap so that they die, very quickly you can end up with maybe 50 zombies. And people have made experience farms out of them uh, and that feature because right. of the way that it works now. Unfortunately, uh, I think that that needs some looking into. They need to fix that for the next update because that would be one of the few complaints I had about the update, in all fairness. So, like... You, I mean, yeah, I, I don't think that the way that zombies like the server is a good is is good. By the way, one thing I never did find is where's the portal down into the main nether? Or the ladder or whatever it is. Oh, it's uh it's just right down here. Oh right through Right through the center. And there's also an in case of emergency flint and steel there. Oh, in case the portal gets broken. I guess that gas yeah. could spawn in here maybe. Because it is big uh, enough. No, creepers. Oh yeah, because they can wander through the portal. Creepers have come through the portal, yeah. Mm -hmm. So the horse trail is down this way. Uh, By the way, if you want to go ahead and check out, uh, here's the Vanilla Go Girl Ultra Hardcore Hall of Fame. Yeah, you showed me this, but I never really looked at it in detail because we were kind of whipping around everything. Runner up right. was Ross. First damage. Is that the first damage is in the first person that got hurt or the first person that dealt damage? First person that uh, got hurt. You. Me. Fall damage. First diamonds, Mondo. First to die, Red Serenity, King of Sandwich, Halak One Forty One Blues, Brickard. These, uh, these are the players. Ah, uh, okay. Winner was Mondo. Then, mm -hmm. Worst death, King of Sandwich. What happened to him? Uh, he got shot by skeletons. Ah, uh, stupidest move. What was that? Uh, me digging up into Mondo's sky base. He <laughs> just dropped lava on my head. <laughs> First PVP, Hal and Brick. First PvP win, Which I how? Killed, I killed, I killed Brick. Ah. Uh, uh, in a village. And then season two was highlighted by zombies. I noticed this. This is a nice pixel art. Runner up, King and Hal, green team. First damage, Ross Vaughn, yellow team. This is when you did the teams, right? First yeah. diamonds, Mondo again. He has a knack for finding diamonds. I'm gonna have to kind of sweet, sweet talk him a little bit. It seems. First to die, Ross Vaughn. Uh, there's the teams again. And Team Red won. Um, one thing I do want to ask is, um, I've never seen Gogurt. Does he ever come on? Uh, Gogurt the first? Yeah, he does. He does. Uh, he's just um, usually really busy with uh, work. I, ima I imagine he is. Schedule. His work schedule's even uh, even harder now because um, summer is, in, you know. Yeah. Everybody wants to build like their gardens and all that stuff. Yeah. By the way, if you want to peek. Uh, this has not been revealed yet, but it's done, and UHC Season 3 has been, you know, released. Yeah. Oh, I love the little three that you've done there. That's awesome. That was, uh, that was Mondo's idea. This is pretty cool. Can't wait. Mm -hmm. In the Season 4 room, my name's going to be right there. You mark my words. <laughs> oh, there, yeah. <laughs> 
Yeah. No, I'll probably die first. I'll probably, I'll probably die first, knowing me. But I play really conservatively, so it depends. Yeah. Plus, I don't know who I will be teamed up with either, so... Right. And you get to decide that, so, uh... There's that. Well, I think it should be really a decision based on everyone, not just... sort of like... Right. Choosing who they want to be with. Which is why I wanted the idea of, of the randomizer, because it makes it more fair, I think. Right, we did random in, uh... Season 2, though, and I think we want to do, uh... You choose your team now, because, um... If you choose your team, you know, you know, um, you can strategize with them early yeah. as well. Yeah, I guess that makes sense. So that's a it's large vein of glowstone. Like a couple minutes. These are some large glowstone pockets. Yeah. This is my first time into the Nether. Actually, I've not been here before, aside from the Nether hub. Some quartz around. I would have thought most of the quartz has been mined out by now. Um, not around here. We didn't really, uh, we haven't really mined around here. Uh, out by where the actual stop is for the, uh, nether trail, it's been pretty mined out. Yeah. There we go. Man, this is a long tunnel. Yeah, it's pretty long. It's about 3,000 blocks away from spawn. Ah. Uh, not too bad in nether terms, though. No, it's about... I don't know. 3,000 3, divided by 8, roughly. Yeah, that's probably... So it's not too bad. It's around maybe 450, somewhere there. Here, let me re-log so that you can see me. I did see you then, actually. Oh, you did? Wow. These are some of the uh, captive ones, I'm guessing. Yeah, those are kings. Um, got some around. These are all the also, untamed ones. Over, yeah. If you go over this hill, uh, there's a little barn that I made. Which hill's that? Oh, up here. Okay. Yeah. Uh, there we go. Particles off. Uh, I, see, I see it. Rain, rain always just messes me up. Oh, I've got so much to live up to with you being such a good builder. That is a sweet looking barn. Watch out. Okay, got him. You've got the hay bales and stuff. Some donkeys. Nice. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Look at all the zombies around. Ah, crud. Crud. Crud, crud. What? <laughs> I don't know what I'm saying even, and it, I don't know what I'm saying even more. Oh my gosh. <laughs> <laughs> Alright then. Sleep to get this rain away. Okay, I'll jump in the bed. I've never seen a player actually lie in a bed while being stood up. <laughs> well, nobody has said anything. I don't know if anybody's actually watching the stream or not. <laughs> This is going to be more of an extended episode, I think. Yeah. That's alright. Is that the port? That's not the portal we came through. No. It's a different portal. Uh, uh, somebody made that after... After that portal was made. Oh, hello. Well, I guess I've got the pick of the bunch here, haven't I? Because there's a lot of untamed yeah. ones. Oh, somebody's commented. How many people are actually viewing the stream? I did not look at that. Oh, oh Dave, is, Dave cool. is here. Dave oh, is Dave's viewing. Here. Yeah, he's viewing. Um, ah, gosh. But I know Dave is at work, so he says the, the stream is not that good. The internet's not very good at his workplace, but... Hello, Davey. <laughs> So, oh no, no, that one, that one's near the lava. Oh, no, he's not going to fall in the lava. I like, I like a horse that lives on the edge. <laughs> Quite literally. Although if I get on and ride him, that's going to mean that I'm going to fall in the lava if I get thrown off. So I'm going to kind of just push him away. <laughs> Go 
go that way. There we are. Yeah, that's a bit safer now. Oh yeah, you have to right click. That's it. Ooh yes. Okay, I like this horse. I think. I don't know. I don't think this is anybody's. I think I'm gonna take it either way. Oh, he better stay away from the lava. Oh, he's running away now. That's that's good. I haven't played with these too much, in all honesty. I got one in Mr. M. Fretwell Plays Minecraft, but I um, and I haven't. I think I've got to this episode actually. Um, unfortunately, I logged in with 1.5 by mistake, so I lost it. Oh dang! And uh, you know what the worst part was? Hmm. One chunk in my entire world got corrupted, and have a guess which one? Uh, the one where your house is probably. Nope. The one oh, no, 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 where the, where the horses are. Uh, no, not that. The one with the storage room in it. <laughs> the one chunk that had my entire storage in it, and it got wiped. Did you make a uh, backup of it? No, I didn't. <laughs> oh, that sucks. Because it was like the episode after I did the storage room, and it was basically pretty much straight after I recorded the episode. I had to go on to... 1.5 to do a, a couple of things on a different world and oh man that was so annoying it really really was thankfully I didn't lose all my diamonds though and stuff like that because they were kept in a separate area they were in my furnace room instead man this horse is really laggy I keep freezing while I'm on it yeah horses uh... horses usually uh... Are a little bit laggy. I've got a really fast one though. I got a fast one, but it doesn't have uh, much health. Is there a place where I could hitch him up somewhere around here? Yeah, you can put him in the. Uh, you can put him in uh, here. There we are. There you go. Gogut's hoofed beast. Is there? A, is this one free here? Yeah, that's that's free there. Uh, I'll, gr I'll grab a sign. Uh, there we go. Close that. There's the sign. If you want to give it a name, you can call it "Living on the Edge." <laughs> <laughs> I'll just put a sign that says Fretwells. Ah, uh, fair enough. Alright, so we've got that done. You know what I hope they bring back into the game in 1.7? Those forests, but without snow. I love those. Yeah. The tiger without the snow, like the pine forest. Right. I love them a lot more when they were like what they were in 1.0 and not with all the snow now. Right. So, uh, anything else that you would like to show me, or...? There's not really... I don't think there's anything else... Um, really that's new on the server, I guess. Um, I don't know. Actually, see if there's anybody on speak. Yeah. I won't be able to hear them though. Yeah, I'm just, I'm just gonna see if uh, anybody is doing stuff or something. I'm gonna head back uh, to the hub. All right. Nope, nobody there. Ah. Uh. I'm going to get TeamSpeak as soon as possible. Um, it's on my list of things to do. No rush. It's just, uh, just um, you know, it's easy, it's an easier way to connect uh, yeah. actually than Skype for us. I'm going to probably, I don't want to go and try and start installing something which next week is going to be invalid because I'm not going to use this PC any longer. 
Oh, well, you could always use it to like edit stuff, even. But... Yeah. I will probably look into that. I've been feeling very uh, exhausted today after the the day trip of disaster. So. <laughs> I'm gonna kind of. I was just taking a relaxing day today, which is why I didn't try and record anything and I just decided to stream today. Bit easier. And I've had the advantage yeah. of being able to stream with someone as well, so that's. that's an added bonus. Not sure what else there is to do on the server really right now. Um, I think you've had enough of mining. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I guess we could always uh, work on a mini game. We've got what? a little uh, little place that we've been working on, clearing uh, clearing out the desert for mini games place. Hmm. Where's that? Is this? On the 1.6 trial or? Uh, here. I'll be there in just a second. It's up in the, uh, up in the main hub. Ah. Uh. It's the desert. The desert, I see it. Well, I guess I'll get some sand out of the deal, which is always nice. And I do need some cactus if it's not already gone. There should be some there, I think. Oh yeah, I was gonna plug in my phone. <laughs> That's right. Oh. Oh oh oh. I just remembered that. Oh, is this gonna be like Gogut Land then, or, or something like Minecraft has Good Land? Some something like that. There's Fane. Well, there is plenty of cactus here. A lot of sand and dirt and stuff around. I can't see you, but I can hear you eating. Ah, uh, there you are. There we go. Oh, sandstone. Oh, I love building with sandstone. I'm glad we came here. <laughs> okay, so... Just gonna do some, uh... Work on a... Uh, paintball arena, I think, is what I wanna do. If you wanna work on that with me. Yeah, sure. Um, I think I'm bigger than that. And by the way, do you think any uh, of the Vanilla Gogut members will be interested in like a list of royalty-free music places? Because I have quite a oh, collection. Definitely, yes. Because I, I can uh, give people links and, and so forth to these different places where there's quite a large selection, actually. Aside from Kevin McLeod, um, there's a couple of other ones that I uh, have used before. I think, aside from Just Kevin's music, probably Purple Planet is what I've used the most, aside from that. How, how wide do you... Uh... What do you think the radius should be for this circle? And it's a it's paintball a ten arena. Right ten right yeah. now, and it's a paintball arena. Um, I'm, I'm thinking like 15 -ish? That's what I was thinking. I wouldn't go any bigger than 15, really. Um, what's it going to be, like a glass dome? Um, it's going to be kind of like the Minecraft 
thing would be. So just some walls, uh, some glass panes for walls or glass for for walls or whatever. Uh, and then like obstacles that you can hide behind. Right. I see you over there, zombie. Never mind, you got him. Ten. Jeez, I had to swing my sword maybe five or six times to hit him. That's fifteen right there. I'm thinking that's about right. Yeah, I I think so. I'm gonna look up here. Yeah, that's that's it. That's it. Yeah, that that seems to be. That's what I was thinking anyway. Maybe fifteen. So is this going to be like a place where you could just build a mini game if you want to? Pretty much, yes. I might look into that. I haven't really done any sort of mini games before, so I wouldn't know exactly where to start. <laughs> just, I just see falling fret walls everywhere. <laughs> oh no. Oh boy. I'm going to try and get an updated viewer list if I can, but according to the viewer list, General Omegas is still here, but he left nearly an hour ago. Let's see. Um, the one in my pop out chat doesn't actually work at the moment. Hmm, that's odd. Look at these two zombies. <laughs> They're trying to reach you. Yeah, and they, I saw that. They, they can't work out that they need to path around. And they said that path in AI was good now. <laughs> and I say a hip, hop, a hip, hip, hop. Hip, hip, hop. <laughs> There's another... <laughs> Can they not work out, then, that they need to climb up onto the, like, the full block? Because... Who knows? They're all doing a hip-hop down here. Yeah, let's, let's have a party, guys. There's just a spider with his, with his back turned, like, I don't even care. Oh yeah, there's some, there's a few cactus in here. If I want them. Cactus, uh, you can toss them down. We're not entirely sure how many people are watching. It says four. I'm gonna refresh my page and see. Yeah. Well, party's over, guys. Uh, just got two of them to get rid of. Is there anything that you need me to do? Hey. Uh, ooh. Hello. Uh, help? <laughs> Why, what's down there? Um. Uh, oh crap, I hit the... There we go. What was down go. there? Just, uh... I have no idea, actually. Um, I guess they must There's have mined it out for sandstone yeah, and stuff. I, guess so. I didn't really look in what was in these chests. That's random stuff in there. Lots of cobble. Even more cobble. Some more random yeah, junk. Uh, Empty chest. Gotten quite a lot of quite a lot of cobble from this. There's ender pearls here. Hmm. Some shears and some melon. I wish you could like cook sandstone and get that smooth variety. Uh, the one that you can only get by using uh, the map tools. I don't know whether you've seen oh, that before. Yeah. The one that Inferno Mines uses. Right. I wish we could kind of cook sandstone in a furnace and get that. That would seem like the logical thing, I think. Like we cook cobblestone for the normal stone right in the mini game area 
I don't think I've ever met Fane, actually. He usually doesn't come on the server too much uh, because of his computer. But, uh, he's gonna get his dad's uh, PC in a while. That, that's what he's on now, actually, eventually. he says. He says he's on that yeah. now. He's eventually gonna get that for himself, so he'll be able to, like, record. Oh, you beat me to it. <laughs> Do you want me to help clear some of this out? Ooh. Could always use some sandstone. I love building with sandstone. Oh, crud, I missed that guy. Okay, I was just checking to see if the server was lagging. You Is it? By, uh, how fast? It looked like the stars were moving a little fast. Nah, that's that's good. I think he's using the Twitch app, which is why uh, he uh, can't search. Oh, true, yeah. Oh, hello, zombies. The, are they doing the hip hop as well? Oh, hello. Did I get some? No, I didn't get any chain for that. Dang it. I noticed the longer you spend in an area now in 1.6, the it seems that the chances of armor dropping gets better. It might just be me though. But with my zombie grinder, I have actually gotten some pretty good stuff, like fully repaired gold stuff with like fire protection four. And while it isn't that great for adventuring, it's great for having on in your base. Just fire right. protection four. I found some feather falling three boots, uh, leather boots. It's not bad. Yeah, I got that once too. That's not bad. Um, I also got almost a fully repaired chain chest plate. They, they do drop some decent stuff now. Um, it's just a shame that the uh, baby zombies pick it up and then you don't get it back. I don't know if there's a, a filter out there that you can use to kind of like filter them out. I don't know how tall they are. Because if they're smaller than a block and a half, then potentially you could send them down a different chute, but I have not tested that. I think they are I think they are a block and a half. Yeah. So we can't filter them out easily. I don't know whether they I think they work the same as zombies as far as villagers are concerned. They will follow a villager. Yeah, they do. Uh they do do that. The the only way I could filter them out, I think off the top of my head would be the sun because they don't burn up in sun but then you would you would lose the zombies which kind of defeats the object right they don't drop they don't drop armor they don't drop xp it's kinda it's kinda sad i wish they did at least just drop some experience if nothing else I think they sh they should get a, a unique drop of some kind. I don't know what, but it should be a unique drop. I wish there was a way to, uh, that zombie flesh could be used. A lot of people said that it should be able to be like maybe smelted into leather um, and then yeah. craft into armor or books. I think that would be a good change. I am not exactly... English as, as people think I am. I'm actually South Sandwich Isles, but there we go. 
Let's see. <laughs> Stereotypes of medical do the, the best of us. I'm, I'm being facetious. I'm not South Sandwich Isles. I'm a mixture of many things. <laughs> I am sort of a, a mixture. I'm kind of, I'm half English, half Irish, but there we go. I really shouldn't be so silly about this stuff because I might end up rubbing someone up the wrong way by mistake. Very good for you, Fan. Irish, English, Scottish, French and Polish. As I always say, I speak three languages. English, Scottish and Idiish. And Idiish. <laughs> Wow, that's good. That's actually really good. <laughs> um, thinking. Oh, he is watching the stream because he, he's just typed that. He's watching the stream. I'm glad. I'm glad Fane's enjoying it. Um, it's not something I've typically done before. So, is there anything you need me to do? Just trying to get a shape down. Does that look okay? Kind of a rounded corner. Yeah, it's uh, it's a circle. Have you got a circle chart? Is that what you're using? Uh, no, I usually just I don't usually use circle chart. I just do it by myself. Just like, oh, that looks okay. <laughs> Well, I don't have any uh, stone bricks on me, so I'll just try and carve out what you've got going on. And that's the end of that pickaxe. I do have one more, though. You wait until I get diamond tools. <laughs> <laughs> I'm tired of using these stone pickaxes. I've actually started to use diamond now to branch mine uh, on my LP world because I have over two stacks of the things. I think I have three stacks now. So, I'm giving up with using stone tools. The thing I'm really burning through all the time is actually iron now, not diamond. Right. Because I always need pistons all the time. Because I use that piston lighting trick where there's a pumpkin below. I'm going to leave that uh, center dirt piece right there. Yeah. Look at you with the Mr. Awesome shovel. <laughs> <laughs> um, so I'm thinking a wasteland theme. What, with the dead bushes and stuff? Yeah. And like, may maybe sand as a floor or, or maybe some clay? I'm thinking dirt, some clay. Yeah. Maybe some fences here and there. I mean, I'm not uh, sort of an aesthetical builder, so I don't really know exactly what would look good together. Well, like what you said, you're you're more for gameplay. Yeah. I guess is what is what you're saying. So I've actually been wanting to do this for a while. I mean, I'm trying to improve my aesthetics, and this is why I've been kind of following what you've been doing and seeing how you do things. But it's not as easy as watching a video, <laughs> put it that way. Yeah. I, I think that, like you say, you have a genuine interest in sort of like engineering and stuff, and I think it's probably where it, where it comes from, certainly with you anyway. Yeah. I wish there was a. I wish that I could just tear through this. It's slabs, isn't it? Yeah. Uh. 
don't know. <laughs> oh, okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. That river, okay. I don't know what river he's talking about. There's a river that leads from his base all the way to spawn village. Oh, and he wants to use it. Yeah, as a mode of transportation. Oh, it's in 1.6. Ugh, no thanks. They changed the way they work. Boats in general. Boats. <laughs> boats. I hate boats in this game. If there's one thing I hate in this game, it's boats. I'll get you some dirt, and I don't know if we've got any clay lying around in nearby access. I'll see if I can find Possibly. some. I'll try and find some. Sand in there. Lots of sandstone. And sand. Let's see if there's any dirt in these chests. Oh yes, there's lots of dirt. I have to say that the one thing that kills me in this game is fall damage. Ironically. I die more to fall <laughs> damage than to mobs. Or lava. Or anything like that. It is always fall damage. That is the only way I have died so far in my LP. Is fall damage. I don't know why, I just always seem to die to fall damage. Anyway, I've got you some dirt, it's right here. Awesome. Actually, if you could, could you start filling in the places uh, yeah. that I've mined out? Yeah, I can do that. Do you want me to do it where the slabs were? Like this? Yeah. Watch out, don't, don't take a step backwards. <laughs> you think you've got it rough and I have a stone pickaxe on these slabs. Hmm. I'm, I'm just going to stop moaning about the stone picks now, it's getting old. <laughs> <laughs> now, wooden tools on the other hand, we've not talk, talked about those yet. <laughs> Yeah, I was uh, talking with uh, one of our other members of Wardos one day, and he said most of the times, uh, most most times when I start up like a world or anything, I just have a creeper blow up stone for me so that I don't have to go through wood tools. <laughs> one way of doing it, I guess. Yeah. I'll probably, when you've got this paintball arena, I'll probably do an episode here in a, in an actual match with some other guys. Yeah. Do you want to put, like, maybe cobblestone around that central dirt block? Although it is elevated, so I guess it doesn't matter. Yeah. There we go. Oh, there's a chicken in the hole. <laughs> That's another thing that we could do is like a, a whole underground part as well to this map. Well, there is. It's all carved out, isn't it? So it kind of... It's already done for you. All you've got to do is kind of make it. Exactly. What would you want to go for? Maybe a maze or something like that? Yeah, I'm thinking something like that. Do you have any torches on you? Because we're going to need to get some light down to prevent monster spawns on here. Now it's become yeah, full do. blocks instead of uh, slabs. And also with dirt's fragile nature, it would probably take out a large chunk of it if a creeper happens to blow up. There we go. Fane's lost. That's why you never follow rivers. You get lost. 
Gonna go exchange for my other work pick. Oh yeah, is that running pretty low? Yeah. One thing, one thing I have worked out is if you have an efficiency four on breaking three pickaxe that's been named, the cost will always stay at thirty-two. It never goes up. At least on my yeah, LP I have world. An efficiency. I have an efficiency five. Uh, this is what I'm using right now is efficiency five. I haven't noticed too much of a difference between efficiency five and efficiency four, so I just stick with efficiency four. Oh crap! Hi. I got the other one, but that guy had gone too far away. So, if you don't mind me asking, where did you find out about me? Did you just run into me on YouTube, or before oh, I yeah, joined I the just server? Ran, just ran into you on YouTube. Ah. Uh, because I'm always interested to find out where people actually find me from, whether it's Reddit or Twitter or whatever it is. I'm always interested to know which works best. But that seems to be most people's answer is just straight up YouTube. I think I, I, think I found you through Cold Fusion, actually. Uh, I think he has liked some of my videos in the past, so maybe. Yeah, and he's also, uh, he also has you as one of uh, his channels that you should check out or whatever. Does he? I haven't checked that out. Well, that's all the dirt in these chests, so we don't have too much dirt left. Maybe there's some in this one? No, that's... Oh, wait, there's a stack in there. We're running pretty low on dirt. Yeah, we can run, we can run by uh, my place or Burke's place or whatever. Yeah. There we are. We've been almost streaming for two hours. <laughs> <laughs> the zombies. What I do like about being on here, though, is if you're recording, people kind of assume that you are, so that you don't get lots of chat coming up. That's one thing I really right. liked. Because if you record on a public server, you always have that to deal with, unless you hide the chat. But there's always somebody who's coming on, and then they don't know that you're recording, and they think you're ignoring them, and you have all that hassle. Yeah, when I'm recording, I usually try to say, like, hi or something. Yeah. Zombies, keep hitting me. Well, we're going to need a lot more dirt. Already on it. Get rid of that guy. I Get love being a inventory possible. What? There we go. Watch out. <laughs> oh crud. I'm gonna be a little Roomba right here and pick up all the dirt. Yeah, that's uh what I need because I don't have uh enough inventory. I have a sort of not bad inventory. Why do I have this egg? I've been, how long have I been carrying that around? I think. Yeah. So everything. Oh, I just heard a creeper. Let me see, what else have we got here that I don't want? Um, flesh, that cruddy old bow, I don't want that really. A single piece of wheat, I'm going to hold on to that for the time being. Oh, I tossed the gunpowder into the pile of the rubbish, but it was only four. I'll toss the flint as well.
Do you have a ladder so that we can get out more easily? I don't have any ender pearls on me at this, this moment. I've got a uh, little, a uh, little walkway up over here. I mean, out of this hole. All oh, right. Yeah. I see. Over there. No problem. Okay. Well, nearly, uh, nearly filled maybe three quarters of this in now. Wow, I'm running low on dirt again. Need a lot of dirt for this. Way more than I ever realize. I need to watch back the second episode that I uploaded of Vanilla Goga actually today. I haven't managed to sit and watch that yet. For some reason I just want to watch that series. I don't typically watch my own stuff back, honestly. Like, Neither do I usually. Unless there's something I know I need to kind of look for, like in the first episode when we had to uh, pick out certain bits and phase them out. <laughs> I don't typically watch my stuff back. Did you actually watch the first episode? Yeah, I did. Did you like the little beef I, I put in there? Yeah. That was pretty good, actually. <laughs> I usually don't do that, but it's just... I got seriously mad at those guys. <laughs> I understand, which is why I beeped it out. <laughs> There we are, and it's done. Excellent. Okay, so, uh... Let's see. For now... What's this going to be doing right over here? Uh, hold on, sorry. No, no problem. Um, that's going to be where the, uh, dispenser for, uh, I don't know, for, <laughs> you know, you know how sometimes, like, uh, they'll, they'll do, like, um, certain people go in the first round, certain people go in the second round, and then, um, then whoever's the winner of those two rounds face off. Ah, uh, okay. I see him creeping over there. Okay, we're gonna need a lot of glass now. Well, you've got a lot of sand from what's been mined out, so... That shouldn't be too much of a problem. Just gonna take yeah. time to cook it all up. Right. And I am running out of bread. I've got some uh, baked potatoes if you need some. I've got eight baked potatoes on me, but nothing significant. Getting those farms started is something I'm going to be doing right after I've done the, the mining stuff. There's a lot of stone shovels in there.
to get the furnaces started. Uh, let's see. Who's actually watching now? My chat seems to just be totally broken. Uh, viewer lists. Come on, load. It's not loading for me either. Mm. So that's the center. Yep. So I'm thinking I want to... Dang it. Uh, would you mind doing me a uh, favor? And, oh, here's a... Uh, we've got me, General Omegas, and Scotty Dude Watcher. Uh. Uh, could you do me a favor and run and grab some... Um, Clay? Gravel. Gravel? Gravel is... Yeah. Do we have any in these chests? Or is it... There's some in here. Um, there is some? Okay. Uh, I'm gonna get as much of it as I can. But most of it is cobble. Cobble would be good too, though. I think. Well, I mean, I've got a stack and a quarter-ish. So I'll get some cobble while I'm here. There's a bit more gravel there. And I can't jump down like you because I don't have feather falling on, so... Do you want the uh, gravel now, or...? Sure, I'll take that now. One, two, three... Thank you. Um... Yeah, that should be good. Gonna grab some cobblestone as well. I've already got cobble, if you want some. I did. Okay, I've got... Um... Oh, are you doing the same type of road style that you did in the village? Not really. Um, you'll see how I'm doing this in just a... Just a little bit. Try and decide. There we go. That's This looks pretty cool, actually. It's supposed to look like a beat-down path. Ah, uh, I see. Well, it certainly does. It looks better once you've filled it in with the dirt. Yeah, that was, uh... That was my plan. Do you want to add any clay in here for the floor, or do you just want to leave it dirt? I think I just want to leave it dirt. If you've got any cracked stone bricks, that might be a good addition. Yeah, I do. I uh, have some at my base and all. I'm just getting a rough setup right now. Uh, makes sense. Um, wait. Sorry. That's all right. Uh, I need some dark wood. 
Oh, there's a, uh, there's oh. some over there. Yeah. I was going to say, I have a ton at my base, but that's a long way away. <laughs> well, actually, it's not that far. It's maybe a thousand blocks out somewhere. But I certainly wouldn't want to walk there. No. Not very interesting footage. If I was doing it off camera, then yeah. I can't wait until I have a, like a base really far out in 1.7, and then I, I walk back on my LP world because I lose my portal, because that's what I do. <laughs> See that wall of chunk error? I have an iron axe with efficiency 1, so I'll be able to help you out a little here. Is that the same axe that destroyed my starter chest? <laughs> oh yes, it is. I meant to just remove the uh, the sign, but it just like <laughs> it decided, nope, I want more. I, I eat more. I think it was probably the fact that we have a haste two beacon as well. Yeah, that that probably uh, probably did something. Because signs break really fast anyway, so. I should have broke it with my with my hand. <laughs> I don't know what I was thinking, but I was like, "Oh, I better break this with my axe because I break all wooden products with my axe." <laughs> but there was n everything was still in it. <laughs> it just it just decided, "Oh, I want to. I'm hungry. I want I want to eat the chest too." <laughs> I think that should be enough uh, wood for now. I have thirteen on me. Yeah, I've got. Um, about a stack. Mr. Fancy Schmanchy Axe. <laughs> I just... I, I move fast when building. Um... Oh, crap. I missed that. Oh, no. Can you toss me the wood, possibly? Yeah. Uh, there we go. It's just the other side of this Thank pillar. You. Um. Sorry, I know you're just kind of watching right now, but, uh. Well, it's fun for the viewers, I'm sure. And I'm learning kind of as I go along as well. Like this, this beaten up road here. Right. I might use that somewhere else, maybe, in a. If I decide to build a run-down place somewhere. Kind of matches my whole Fret's cabin that I build at every base. Always build a little cabin before I go into doing my main build. Just saves that problem where creepers can just wander into your chest and blow up if you're nearby. That's why I have it all inside. Let's see. There's no real kind of washed out wood, is there? So you couldn't really make wood look kind of battered and old. Uh, if you do, like, a couple different types of wood, it makes it look older. Ah. Uh, I have some oak on me if you want some of that. Um. Sorry, I'm, I'm kind of moving fast here, so, uh. This is how I am when I build. Ah. Uh, I have ideas flowing through my head. And a pearl everywhere. Just move fast. Plus that, and I've got music on, so that usually. Ah. Uh, I'm surprised you could even hear me with music on as well. I usually turn my music low. Ah. Uh. Oh, so this is like a ladder where you can climb up and maybe shoot people from up here. Right.
That sounded like um, a very slow eating animation. <laughs> oh, got an ankle biter. <laughs> <laughs> like I said, I move fast when I build. Look at this guy. Man, he's running. He is so far away right now and he's hitting me. But my connection's pretty poor. Yeah. I don't know really why that happens because it's not the server. Um, because I've seen in your videos you don't really sort of lag. It seems to be something I on think my it's end. Because of your connection. Do you want these? The server is in Phoenix, Arizona. Uh, which is more than across the world for you. There's your planks. I've got them back again. Thank you. I'm gonna take care of this clown. There we go. There we go. I've not done bad when I've connected to servers in New York, but I don't know. Arizona might be just outside the range of, of decent connection, it seems. Sometimes it can be okay, other times it can kind of be a bit meh. Yeah. What am I doing? I have no idea. It's not like I'm getting lag on my computer. I'm managing anywhere between 40 and 50 frames at the moment. High 30s at the lowest. Right. Well, I don't have a very good internet connection anyway, so I have a slow upload speed, that's for sure. Don't get yourself killed down there. <laughs> I'm just taking out all the zombies while you're building up there. My sword has almost run out though, and it is my last one. I got a spare sword in my in my under chest. Oh boy. These bouncers look like they want to rough me up a little bit. And that's the last of the bread onto just the eight baked potatoes that I have now. On the, on the bright side, I have 25 levels. Not long till I get to 30. Yeah, I like what you've done with the the stairs and like these fences here. Very nice. And that I think that will suit the environment as well, especially if you get some cracked bricks in here, that kind of thing. Right. I'm just getting this down as a start. Yeah. Well, I mean, flare and stuff can be added later. Function before form. Yep, that's that's it. Hmm, okay. Well, 
I think I'm going to have to be wrapping up pretty much now, I think. Because it's been... Get a start on this, though. Yeah. I think it's, it is coming up for two and a half hours, and I need to get a bit worn down. <laughs> <laughs> but it's been a lot of fun to do a, a stream with you, and I hope to do uh, another stream with you very soon. Yeah. And uh, we've got thanks a lot for, done today. Uh, thanks, for thanks for letting me join you. Ah, no problem. Um, we've got a lot of stuff done. I've got a horse now. We did the mining that I wanted to do, and we've got the start of the paintball arena done. I don't know. Sorry, I'm still I'm still moving <laughs> with this. So. Uh, but yeah, thanks for uh, thanks for letting me join you. Yeah, um, it's been a lot of fun, and I hope to do it again fairly soon. Um, I'm just going to head back to my base now, and I'll probably log out from there. Um, Alrighty. Need a bit of a rest. Oh, here, here's the nether hub, so it's not that far away. And I will be making this live to YouTube, guys, so anybody who joined later on, or if you want to watch it back, Hal, then you are more than free to. I'll try and get it uh, uploaded at some time, either today or tomorrow. I'll see what I can do. Okay. No and uh, enjoy episode two as well. If you've liked this stream and you've not seen or heard of Vanilla Gogut before, um, check out my video and obviously then everybody else's channels are in the description from there. So if you want to watch anybody else's, then all the links that you will need will be there. So... That's going to be about it from me, guys. Um, I don't know whether Hal wants to continue streaming over at his channel, but for me, it's, I guess, uh, goodbye for now. Um, yeah. On to uh, getting some other things done. So, until next time, guys, I guess it's going to be a, a see you later, and a have a good day. And see you later, Hal. Have a good day, man. See you later.